these are my results. I, I'm thoroughly impressed. I, hello, beautiful humans. Welcome to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Tessa Stewart. If you're a returning subscriber, welcome back, beautiful. So in today's video, I will be reviewing the Tymo Ring Plus Ionic Hair Straightening Comb. So if you were ever interested in this device and you want to see my first impressions, how it worked on my hair, whether or not I recommend, then just keep on watching. But before we move any further, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Hit the notification bell so that you are alerted with all of my future uploads. And let's get right into the video. I know I'm looking crazy, please excuse, but we're about to get this thing together in a second. But before we get started, I just wanna give you a little backstory. Quite a few months ago, I can't remember exactly how many, a supporter actually reached out to me on Instagram and asked me if I had ever used this. I said no, I said I'd look into it. I looked it up, but I had never heard of it, so I kept it moving. The company reached out to me actually and asked me to review it and do a video on it. So I figured, let me go ahead and do it and this way I can give you my honest thoughts and you can see whether or not it's worth your money and whether or not it will work for you if you have similar texture to mine. But let's just go over some of the specs of the device and what's included. The Timo Ring Plus uses advanced negative ion technology for frizz-free, shiny, healthy looking hair. It has titanium teeth to grip the hair smooth and create shine. It warms up in 60 seconds and it has an innovative anti-scald design. So it has nine temperature levels for different hair types and it turns off automatically after 30 minutes for your own safety and protection. Included in the box, you get two hair clips, a detangling brush, as well as a heat protected glove. Now this glove is supposed to help you while you style your hair. My first impression of the device, it looks a bit more like a brush than a comb. So that actually makes me feel a little bit better about it. I feel like more of your hair, more of each strand will get exposed to the plates. So I'm a little excited about that. So I have my device set on 390. I'm gonna test it out on 390 first. And if that doesn't work, then I will move it up, bump it up to 410. Generally, that's around where I flat iron my hair. Tymo also sent over their heat protected mist. So this will actually be the first time I'm trying this. This is argon oil infused and it is supposed to protect your hair and help it shine. Because my hair is already washed and blow dried, I'm just gonna divide it up into sections, spray some of this heat protected on, and we're gonna get right into the demo. All right, beautiful, so my hair is sectioned off, okay? Normally, I start in the back, but I'm curious to see what this does. So I'm gonna do one section here. We'll see like what difference it makes in the hair here maybe do like two little small sections here and then I'll move to the back and you'll be able to see that. But I just wanna see what it's like. So ooh, be careful because this part gets very, very hot, okay? So let's, let's go ahead and try. Okay. It's definitely straight. Definitely straight. It's definitely shiny. Feels okay. Gets close to the root. Okay, all right, so I'm comfortable with this temperature moving forward. I'm gonna go ahead and do the rest of my hair and I'm gonna do it all on 390. Actually, 390 might be a little bit much. I'm gonna put the temperature down to 370. I'm gonna try it there and I'm gonna do start from the back and work my way, okay?
right, so I finished the back and that was really quick. <laughs> so if anything, I am definitely impressed by the quickness. This has been, I'll tell you the rest of my thoughts at the end, you stay tuned. I'll give you the exact amount of time it took me to do what I'm doing, but this is very quick and you get decent results with one pass. That is not a gimmick, it's real, okay? So I'm gonna show you here in the front. I'm gonna take the Timo and place it into my hair like so and just come straight down. And you can even get your edges, like watch. See? All right, let me just keep going. And then at the end, I'm gonna show you a styling trick with this, something that I realized with the back. We'll talk about it at the end. All right, so something that I'm figuring out, please forgive me if you hear background noise, it's hot in here. So I have on the AC and the fans, but to get your root really good, what you wanna do is you wanna go in with this and you wanna keep this uh, kind of parallel to your head so that you can really get down into the root like that. And then once you get it out further, then you can direction the hair down, okay? So hair straight out so that you can get really good into the root to get the root straightened and then direct down. In root, direct with hair held out and then as you comb out, direct the hair down, okay? All right, so my hair has been completely straightened. There's clearly a difference between the before and after. Obviously, there's no real style to it. So what I've learned by doing this so that you can just use one tool, I have a trick. So I only did one pass for each section, so I'm not really concerned. I'm gonna go in, and when you're using this, if you over direct, it will bend your hair a little bit. So I'm gonna go through, and I am going to divide in larger sections and just do one quick bump under with the Timo just to show you how to style your hair. All right, beautiful, these are my results. I just put a little bit of edge control on the side. Okay, so these are my results. I, I'm i thoroughly impressed. I, I think it did its job. It did a very good job. It got my hair straight. Now, I ended up straightening my hair on, I turned it all the way down to 370, and I actually did my hair on 370. I probably could have gotten smoother results with the higher setting, but when I did the first section and I saw how sleek that first section was, I dialed the temperature back because I didn't want my hair bone straight. <laughs> I did one pass per section. And then when I was finished, I went in and I did like basically four large quadrants and then I bumped my hair under using the Timo, which was actually pretty simple. Guys, this whole thing took me like 20 minutes. I'm not joking. Because you only have to do one pass and because you're not worried about chasing uh, your hair with an actual comb, it's, it's pretty quick. So you're cutting out like an extra step. Like if you straighten your hair with a flat iron, you know a lot of times that we do the chase method, you follow your hair with a flat iron behind a comb. So put, to put the comb in and do all those extra steps takes more time. But when you're using this, you don't have to do that. So you don't even realize that you're cutting out an extra step and saving time. And it does not take me long to straighten my hair at all, okay? This cut that time down even more. For first impression, I'm, I'm actually thoroughly impressed. I actually enjoyed using it. You could use this and just go. If this is like your basic look, if you're not trying to like curl your hair or anything like that, I think that if I'm in a rush, I will totally 
totally reach for this because it gets you very good results very quickly. This is perfect for the woman who is trying to simplify her life. You just want one step, you wanna straighten your hair, you want a nice little bump under and you wanna get out the door. It's pretty plug and play very straightforward. If you straighten just like this straight down, you'll notice that your hair will flip up a little bit, but you can reverse that with the straightener. You can actually do it from the underside and do one pass on each section and that'll automatically give you like a nice bump under instead of like completely bone straight. And I did that for a few of the sections in the back. I think that the Timo Ring Plus is actually a very well put together device. It's very sturdy, it's not flimsy whatsoever. If you're interested in trying it, I say give it a try, it's actually worth it. Be sure to click the link in the description box. You try it out and you come back and you let me know how it works. You can either let me know in the description box below or you can follow me on Instagram and you can let me know in the DM, sis, if this works for you. Now, my thoughts on this heat protectant, I would have to wash my hair and let you guys know. I will update it in the description box below if I don't insert a clip into this video <laughs> of my hair. So if there's no clip inserted in the video, please look in the description box for my recommendation on this argan oil. It actually is pretty lightweight. It doesn't weigh your hair down whatsoever, which is one of the things that I look for. So upon initial use, I actually like it. I think I might continue to use it even though I do have my staples. Maybe when I use this, I'll use these two together. All right, sis, that's all I have for you today. I hope that you enjoyed today's video. If you did, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Hit the notification bell so that you are alerted with all of my future uploads. And if you made it this far, you are a real one, and I love you for that. And I will see you in the next video. Bye.